Somebody ring the dinkster! Oh, my first video. I really need to think, what was it? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. It was somebody ring the dinkster number one. Nah, but... <laughs> it pretty much started with a shower thought. I came up with a great name of the channel. I uh, thought nobody else is doing it, so fuck it. <laughs> Just wanted to do it. <laughs> Somebody ring the dinkster! Oh, fuck me. Uh, they are trying to become a little bit better, I guess. They did some pretty good things lately, like um, at least trying to condemn the actions of Logan and Jake Paul. But still, um, I'm still not happy with the monetization system and just the content promotion, including the trends. I mean, everybody knows how much cancer the trends are. Somebody ring the dinkster! Well, there are actually a few. Obviously, I like those um, meme YouTubers like Rende, Lihonium, and stuff like that. But I also watch actually a lot of German YouTubers still, like for example Pete's Meat, and also some other um, English-speaking um, gaming YouTubers, like for example I saw a production. He does Hearts of Iron videos, for example. Uh, hey. Somebody ring the dinkster. Well, I didn't really get affected by the apoc uh, apocalypse because my videos, it's all a scene from a kid's movie, so they obviously get monetized. But I, I'm not making any money anyways, I just use the monetization to get a better YouTube algorithm. So I'm not really that much affected. <laughs> Somebody ring the dinkster! I got invited by Nihonium actually. He messaged me on Steam and said there's a YouTuber Discord server and that I should join it. Nihonium was like the only other YouTuber that I knew before I joined this uh, council of YouTube Discord. Somebody ring the dinkster! <laughs> you know what's gonna come. I really like it. It's really helpful. But God, let's get just fucking rid of those purples, mate. Let's get rid of them. <laughs> I don't like the purples. Somebody ring the dinkster! Oh, definitely. Um, the promotion uh, of certain content, certain... Um, ways of thinking that YouTube likes and that YouTube that wants to become like TV pretty much and promoting more TV stuff than actually their own stuff. Somebody ring the Dinkster! Dinkster Daily. Somebody ring the Dinkster! My channel is obviously um, at risk of being terminated because of spam for some obvious reason. And I already planned for a channel, like for some backup channel, in case uh, my channel would be terminated. And that would still be Dinkster content, but more like those short Dinkster memes, like in the style of Nihonium and Grande. Somebody ring the Dinkster! Well, oh, I think in uh, my own Discord there were some people kind of freaked out that I was in a voice chat for some reason. I'm not really big, but still some people just fucking freak out because of me. Then there are those people that um, just join the channel to listen to me talk for some reason. And then there are the people that just 
get absolutely annoying because they want me to shout them out for some reason and become mods they usually get just get banned but those are also pretty much the only fan interactions that i have so far with 18,000 subscribers you don't get that much except maybe some cool moments like for example when i play counter strike with some friends shit Somebody ring the dinkster! In my comment section there are some uh, some memes developed there. For example, um, the It's True meme made by a guy called Mi the Pan Man, where everybody where he um, comments it true and everybody else replies with it true. And um, there's always the guys that can't wait for the next number. Uh, most commonly, Danky Kang. He always gets the top comment in my comment section. Then there are some other people. One guy makes a fa fiction of the Dingster right now in my comments with a word every day. And also other people like people. One guy is commenting a heart every day. One guy comments hi Dingster every day. That's pretty much um, what happens there. Somebody ring the dinkster! It's a complicated for my kind of channel because I do not see where I can call up with anybody on those kinds of videos I have. Except when um, a fan or another YouTuber makes a video uh, of the dinkster and I featured on my channel like um, I did with Suranek. Somebody ring the dinkster! I actually, because of my channel concept, I do not really encounter haters. There are people that ask me why the fuck I'm doing this shit, but I do not see those people as haters, to be honest. There are no people that are attacking me personally for what I do because, like, there is nothing to attack, to attack me with on my channel right now and but haters you always need to think about what is a hater you know many people just think of haters in a different way while some people always feel like somebody's a hater that just criticize them or their videos and some people don't see other people as hater even though they get personally attacked by those so but what I can just say is, if it's a very local, uh, vocal um, minority that's attacking you personally, just fucking block them in your comments. Just get the fuck rid of them. It's just one click. Somebody ring the dinkster! Uh, well, obviously it's very fucking frustrating to, um, start with youtube you don't get any fucking views you don't get any fucking subscribers the best thing you can pretty much do is um that you just promote your content on places where people can see it because let's be real your channel is not gonna do anything if you just upload videos people also need to see it and they usually do not see it over youtube my channel, for example, got a kickstart because I posted my channel into various subreddits and it got um, upvoted pretty heavily on some of them, which uh, made other YouTubers talk about me and that kept the stone rolling. Somebody ring the dinkster! 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 Thanks for having me here.